Some viewers may find this disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. What's good, everybody? It's Destin Choice, and you're watching Choice TV. Y'all saw the title, and pretty much, no. I'm not moving out yet, but I will be moving out soon. If you've been subscribed to me long enough, you know I hate living in my motherfucking house. Like, living in my house is so fucking annoying that it's so damn funny. I'm moving out at 18. For those of you who are wondering, I'm 16 years old and I plan on and I'm so dedicated to move out at 18. Like y'all ain't got no motherfucking idea. Like I'm going to be out. Like I will leave on my 18th birthday if I have to. Nigga, I will find six roommates and live in a damn trailer park just to get the fuck out of my motherfucking house because it's so damn annoying. I'm not like most teenagers who say, oh my god, my mom took away my iPhone. Oh my gosh, she's always complaining about the house is always dirty. Nigga. My mom annoying is like to another fucking level. Like my mom is so annoying. Like you have to actually meet her to realize it. Like the thing about my mom is, we live in Florida, right? We live in Florida. You know Florida is the motherfucking sunshine state. It'd be like 85 degrees outside, 82 degrees outside. It'd be hot as fuck. And my mama, she be leaving the AC off or the shit be on 93 degrees. And I just be like, Whoa, mommy, it's hot as hell. I mean, can you please turn the AC on? And she's like, ah, it's that hot. You hot? Go take a shower. You know what? It's okay. Whatever. 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 And another thing, my motherfucking sister still lives with us. She's a grown ass woman. She's gonna, she's gonna be 30 soon. She's in her late 20s. And she has a kid. Her kid is a little disrespectful. And by disrespectful, let me explain. She opens my room door. I'm sure my little girl is four years old. She has no respect. She opens my room door, she takes the covers off my head, and she does this. Fuck you, bitch. Fuck you, bitch. And then like, she spits in my face and says, Fuck you, bitch. Bitch. And I just be like, No, no. I'm like, No, move. Stop doing that. And she'll be like, Oh, bitch. And I just be like, No, get off my bed. You're disrespectful. Get off my bed. And then her mom be like, Don't fuck me out of my kid. And I just be like, Girl, your kid is disrespectful. Spin on me, telling me, fuck you, bitch. Like, what in the hell is up with that? And like, sometimes she'll swing on, my, swing on the doorknob. Like, she'll grab one end of the, door, the doorknob, like, she'll grab the, the outside of the doorknob, and then she'll grab the other side, and then she'll swing back and forth and be like, fuck you, bitch. Fuck you, bitch. Oh, bitch. Bitch. And like, one time my mama was like, no, you can have no candy. She was like, oh, bitch. I was like, oh my god. Like, why am I getting spit on? Like, that just spits on, she spits on me, she spits on my brother. It's so fucking uncomfortable and disrespectful. That kid is pretty much spoiled. Like, just what I'm telling you, the kid is spoiled motherfucking Ryan. Like, it's a mess. And living with my sister, like, she is a damn slob. Like, she is a fucking slob. Like, she literally be fucking drinking half a cup of juice, leave that shit on the counter, and she leaves it there overnight. And it is, it be this big ass sticky juice ring on the damn counter and shit. And it's so fucking annoying and it's so fucking disgusting. Like, that's no motherfucking home training. Like, what the fuck is wrong with you, bitch? How old are you? I never seen a grown ass woman, a woman at that, grown as fuck, leaving juice rings on a damn motherfucking counter. And then this bitch, bruh. This bitch, she uses an excessive amount of toilet paper. Like, she wraps a whole bunch all over her damn hand. Wraps her fat ass coochie, apparently, because she uses this much toilet paper. And then she pees, and then she leaves big ass walls in the damn motherfucking toilet. And I just be like, bruh, she ain't even flush. How the fuck you don't flush? And the whole bath be smelling like piss, piss and shit. Like, no, like, that's so disgusting. And then sometimes when she, she, when she be getting juice or milk or whatever, she puts the top on halfway. Like, you know, sometimes when you don't tie the top on right and, it, like, it pops up, like, it's all slanted and shit. She turns it so sloppy. And then she, you know how sometimes when juice, you can't leave it standing up tall. Sometimes you got to put juice lying down in the same space. She be doing the juice lying down in the morning, next day. Juice all over the damn fridge. Bruh. And then she be getting all mad and snapping and shit, saying, y'all was waiting for me to see this. Y'all could have cleaned this up for me. Bitch, you were grown ass on How the fuck you leaving juice all over the damn fucking fridge and not even put the top on correctly? What in the hell? Like, it's just so fucking annoying. And it's like, people love to fucking disrespect other people's belongings. Like, my cup is right there. And then you'll just drink out of it and just touch it. Like, it's just annoying as fuck. It's disrespectful. I have to put up with a lot of shit. If you really want to know, like, more, you will have to watch my story times. I get disrespected all the time by my fucking sibling. Just disrespectful as fuck. But let me get into this. 
I am starting to save money. Okay, so pretty much I'm starting to save money. Let me put it this way. So far, don't fucking judge me, bitch. I've saved about 50 bucks to move the fuck out of my house. Don't let me let me finish. Let me finish. Pretty much with this 50 bucks, I'm going to save, save, save. Because I'm pretty much getting older, realize that I need to separate my wants with my needs. And I know, and I know what you're thinking. Oh, 50 dollars don't get you no fucking wear. Bitch, I'm trying. I'm trying, I'm saving, I'm saving, I'm saving, and I'm saving. You know what? Fuck this shit. Few dollars don't get me ain't gonna get me shit but a damn taco, but it's a start. It's a start and I'm trying. And plus, I'm going to move with like seven fucking people just to get the fuck out of my house because it's just a fucking mess. Like, I will be moving out when I'm 18 on my graduation date, hopefully. But I will move out at 18. I'm very dedicated to this. And I'm not going to be up in this fucking house. No. Fuck no. Like, I'm willing to work hard as fuck. Hard as fuck. I will clean a shitty ass diarrhea bathroom as long as I'm getting a good, stable income. As long as I'm working, doing what I can. I will do my best to save money until this is about three thousand dollars. I ain't moving out until I have at least three thousand dollars plus three other people, at least three other people in on it helping me. You know, but yeah, I do not like living in my house at all. It's a fucking mess. It's annoying as fuck. Disrespect. Don't like it. I'm gonna be out. I can't change it. I can't tell my mom nothing because my mom don't do shit about it. But I gotta do what I gotta do. I gotta be on my own. If I gotta be on my own, I gotta be on my own. So it's all good. But yeah, that's that. Like, comment, subscribe. Hit that thumbs up button. Trust out this bitch.